Hey, welcome back. This video is going to be discussing how to customize the widgets on your web page. Okay, so once you log into your KV Core web page, you can actually view what you'd like to see and the current view of your web page just by selecting your name and also the website link. Okay, so currently this is what the website looks like. As you can see, there's a custom widget here beside a non-custom widget. So we're going to actually change this one right on the right side. And you're going to just go back to your dashboard and select that web and IDX field. Okay, so we are here. Go to site editor on the right hand side and scroll down. So at this stage, you can do two things. One is click on the image you click that backspace and you can delete the image. Then you click over here and click insert image. You can drag it or just click and drop. So for example, I'm going to select these condos, right? Scroll all the way up. You can make it as large as you'd like. Maybe if I want to create it like that, I can make this one smaller so it matches. There we go. Looking to purchase a Toronto condo. And then we can select the edit link here. And you can change that to any link you desire. For example, it could even be one of your squeeze pages. Um, so for us, we have our squeeze pages. Just going to select one of those. And you're going to want it to open in a new tab, click update. So now looking to purchase a Toronto condo, thinking of selling a Toronto condo, we're happy with what, how it looks. We're just going to click save and then save successfully. However, if you do make a boo-boo and you click save, just jump back over to your web and IDX field, click on the edit settings and change your template again. So for example, if you're in the standard view, change it to luxury, make sure you click save, replace, and then just go back to that other view that you wish to do. However, you are going to need to change um, whatever widgets you've already done. You're gonna make sure that you put them back to the way that they were. Okay, well, happy editing, and uh, let me know if you need any assistance.